My name is Anna Bostrom and this is my application video to be on season three of The Outstanding Artist. This last year taking the mastery program has single-handedly been the most amazing and busiest year I've ever had in my entire life. I um, started school full-time. I was able to go to Greece with you guys, which was just a wonderful, beautiful experience. Like Meeting everybody and learning from uh, the Milans was just phenomenal and I hope to go back soon. Um, I got married and uh, my husband and I went to Italy and then when we got back from Italy, I bought a house. Well, we bought a house <laughs> and we are currently renovating it. It is crazy and fun and during the house buying and renovating process, uh, my business completely blew up overnight and everything that I've worked for this past year, everything i wanted, everything I have been manifesting and dreaming about and journaling about literally all came true. I never thought that my life could be what it is today. And I never thought that I could paint the way that I've learned how to paint. I know that I would be a great contestant for the show because I was that person that knew nothing about art. I mean, literally nothing. Uh, before starting the mastery program, I had no idea how to draw. I didn't know how to paint. I am somebody who came in with no skills whatsoever. And the mastery program has completely molded me into this artist and things started clicking for me. And I find that to be incredibly relatable to a lot of people that could watch the show. And people would be watching it and maybe they say the same things that I used to say. Maybe they say, I can't do that. And I, there's no way that I could do that or, or they allow their fear to get in the way of like just their true, true potential of like what they want. Honestly, taking that fear out of your vocabulary and just your mindset and making it more positive, you get more out of life. You get more out of your art. You get more out of your passion. So what would make me such a great contestant for the show is that I was that person. I would love to be able to show people like, yes, you can. You can do this. Yes, there's going to be challenges. Yes, it's going to be hard. But you can do it. You just have to try. I truly know that and believe that that would make me a great contestant. I think I'm a lot of fun to be around. I'm pretty bubbly, pretty goofy. I end up making some pretty weird faces sometimes, <laughs> I've been told. I could be dramatic, but in a good, good way. So if you need me to like dramatically faint at some point, I can do that. Yeah. So I'm very, you can add flexibility and willingness to go the extra mile <laughs> as part of my application, for sure. I think I'd be big competition for people. There would probably be people on the show that, who maybe have more experience under their belt. And frankly, I think I could only just learn from them, but don't underestimate me. I learn quickly. I, um, I feel like I pick up my skills very quickly. It'd honestly, just be such a thrill to be in these competitions and these challenges and collaborating from other artists and learning from other artists is also one of my biggest drivers to be on the show. Frankly, I feel like my life this last year has been its own version of The Outstanding Artist and handling the pressure and giving myself challenges and competitions to better myself as an artist has what has helped me become as successful as I've been. I would be a great addition. I'd be a great competition. Uh, definitely don't underestimate me because I am a very fast learner. I absolutely love being in Greece with you all last year. And I miss the food. So that's, it's like probably number three for sure. Um, <laughs> thank you so much for your consideration. I hope to see you all soon in Greece. Bye.